All right, it is time. It's time for the World Cup. So, I was supposed to record the group stage draw. I did record it. Do you think I can find the file for it? No. So, the the group is this. It's it's it's, it's uh, France, Holland, Paraguay, and Tunisia. If we were to get a result against Paraguay, you'd think we're through. You know, at least second because we'd be we'd be Tunisia. But you would think that. But this was our friendly results: one all against Israel, one all against Venezuela. 2-1 defeat against the USA, and a 4-1 thrashing against Colombia. The Colombia game, in football manager, since I've been playing football manager, I don't think I've ever been battered as much as he did in the Colombia game. We were awful, but that was a friendly. And now we've got Paraguay. So, we're going to get straight into it. Clover does start. I was debating starting him up front, but I feel like I'm going to start... Um, Someone else. Wait, hang on. I don't want to start Van Persie. I want to start Bass Dost. So, the team is Sillison in net. A back four of Williams, Stefan de Vrij and Virgil van Dijk with Joel Veltman on the right. Midfield three of Daly Blint, Kevin Strootman and Jorginho Y. Naldon in the front three. Memphis Depay, Bass Dost and Justin Kleibert. <clears throat> Strong bench, Promes, Van Persie. I'm getting a text message. Well, it's not what I want. On the eve of, of a massive game, people texting me. God damn it. Right. Time to play Paraguay. Oh, Belgium. Time to play Paraguay. If Tunisia got a result, that would change the whole complex of the group. After the qualifiers, I was pretty confident. I was really confident that we were going to do well in this World Cup. But after four friendlies in which we... Lost 2, drew 2, won none. Against Israel, Venezuela, the US and Colombia. I'm not as confident as I once was. So, we'll, we'll just see what happens. We'll just jump into it. So we've got France in the middle. But if we get a resort against Paraguay, a good win, then, then you know. Uh, the goal is the semi-finals. the very least, we have to get the quarterfinals. If we didn't get through the groups, that would be... That would be really bad. That would be upsetting. France do beat Tunisia. Not comfortably. Um, Martial took a penalty before Gassim, Gass, Gassimi for Tunisia scores. Before Griezmann won it. So it's our turn then. In group H. Now, this I don't think I've touched on this. Iron Robin is not in the squad. Iron Robin is not in the squad. Decided to announce his retirement after the uh, the Luxembourg game. So, yeah, Iron Robin is not at the World Cup. I did ask him to reconsider because I thought, you know, the World Cup is next year. Surely he'd want to play the World Cup and then retire. But no, he's gone. Let's go. Wijnaldum didn't start any of the friendlies. He's back after a broken ankle. Bastost. Oh, it's white Depe. It's got a little bit of a niggle. Do I take him off? I'm going to take him off. Just, I, I can't risk. Because if I keep him on and then he misses the whole World Cup, it's going to be a disaster. So I've got to take him off. That's a big block to 25 minutes. Hopefully Quincy Promes can, can do something. Oh God, please. Please, no. Paredes is banged it in the top corner for Paraguay and it is 1-0 ah uh, it's a problem it's problematic mm, this is this is really concerning I'm very worried 1-0 down at half time to Paraguay I've had to take their pay off uh, this isn't very good we've got to do something otherwise we're going to need a, a win against France and on the back of our recent performances, it doesn't look like that's going to happen. We're missing Robin. <laughs> Come on, at least get a point. Right, something's got to happen. Right. Come on, Robin. Something, just do something. I don't care what it is. Just put the ball in the back of the net. That is a big steaming pile 
of shite. That was awful. That was a really bad performance. That's not good. That's concerning. So, that means we're going to have to go and play France. And we're going to have to go and win. So, let's see if we can do that. Oh. Alright, we're going into this game against France. Knowing that three points. Or we're going home early. Justin Clivert starts up front because it's all or nothing. Counter-attack. Would four points be enough to go through? Depends if Tunisia could beat Paraguay. Oh, France on the attack. Goodies, man. Sillison catches. Can there be a break? Memphis. Oh, he's lost it to Kante. We just feel so laboured. In all the friendlies and against Paraguay, it was just... It was like we just forgotten how to play football. It's almost since Robin retired. We just seem to have just just turned awful. Dembélé. Oh, it's Martial. It's in. It's one 0 It's one 0 to France, and I think we're going to be going home really early. <laughs> Oh, Wijnaldum has scored. Hope for Holland. Up to third. We still need more. We still need three points in this game. Trigini on Wijnaldum equalises. Oh, please don't lose it now. If we lose it now, we're going home. Sidibe. Oh. Are we out? Let's have a look at how the other game went. It wasn't a terrible performance. It was better than the Paraguay one. Now, let's have a look. They haven't played yet. We're going to need... Oh, it's a nil-nil draw. Okay, so we need to beat Tunisia. And France need to beat Paraguay. Or Paraguay need to beat France. As long as we beat Tunisia. If it's a draw. Although if it's a draw. We're out. So as long as one of them lose. Oh god. Right. I'll come back to the Tunisia game. In the next episode. So this is it for this episode. France or Paraguay need to lose. And we need to beat Tunisia. See you next time. Peace.